Lance Armstrong, arrogant and unaware, did little to repair his image in me culpa with Oprah across 90 minutes with Oprah Winfrey, Lance Armstrong did more than admit he cheated to win his 7 Tour de France titles. He revealed a measure of the man that he is and this much is certain, if you never met this jerk, well, count your blessings. Defiant, distant, difficult. Arrogant, unaware, flippant. Oh, Lance had a plan to try to look open and honest, and that was what was so obvious, it was a plan. It sounded rehearsed. But when he went off script, well, that's when he went off the rails. He apologized, and that's worth something, worth a lot to those of us who aren't outraged anymore over doping in sports. But in doing so, in tuning into the Oprah Winfrey Network, you could only marvel at that personality on display, the same one that while we celebrated his victories was, behind the scenes, leaving a path of personal destruction in its wake. This was a glimmer of the true Lance Armstrong coming out. No Nike commercial edits. No press conference sound bites. No glowing magazine profiles. This was the guy who left scores and scores of people cursing that their paths ever crossed. It's not about the bike, indeed. This was about Lance's sociopathic spectacle. At one point during the interview, he couldn't recall how many people he'd sued. Really. He not only didn't know the number, he couldn't even be sure when asked about specific individuals that his mighty, powerful legal team relentlessly tried to bury.